of our journey but it's actually day one of Corsa Rally. We're in New Jersey at this beautiful rest stop. We were supposed to all be white squad and have all white cars but I kind of didn't want to do white so as you can see everyone else is white and then this truck pulled up behind so we might just have their truck replace my car. Looks like a pretty good place for Mark to do a burnout now that he has a rear wheel drive conversion uh, on his GTR. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love the Lincoln Tunnel. Bumper to bumper traffic. It's gonna take 33 minutes to go four miles, three miles. Got the LP560 Spider right there. A new GT3 just blew by us in some lane over there. I don't know what it is. I think he's running in the bus lane. But heading to the hotel. This tunnel sucks. God damn it. We're in New York City. We got the cake. We're going to Times Square. Check out these cars. 458, F12, Aventadors, 650S. It's gonna be a good one. We got the Aventador. What's up? We got the king. That is insane. Look at that. We're in Times Square and we shut down the street. Check out this lineup. A Ventador, we got the Bat Ventador. Got a Huracan. Another Aventador. And a Wyra. Check this out. <laughs> Unfortunately, the king has sustained some damage to the front lip. But apparently it also might be upgraded to the Tempesta body kit with some new wheels. It is officially day one of Corsa Rally even though it feels like we've been rallying for a while already. Last night was absolutely insane. We took these cars out and the Wyra. Uh, basically shut down Times Square. It was pretty unforgettable. Now we're going to DC doing a fuel stop because all these cars get horrible gas mileage. This gets literally three miles per gallon in the city. So I think mine gets about five. And here we see an Aventador owner fill up his gas. <laughs> it's not even 93! It's not? No. It's 87. This might be the last time this engine looks like this. <laughs> ah! Oops. That looks like a shark bit in. Oh man. <laughs> There's so much excitement everywhere, I don't know what to point at. Look at that. <laughs> the one Got the one of one cup holder with the Starbucks. Pulled off at a pit stop because the red Aventador has a catalyst overheat warning. Not a bad place to stop though. I love this Aventador Roadster, the dog. And we got Bat Ventador. You love Bat Ventador. I love Bat Ventador. I changed my mind. I love this one more. <laughs> Finally, a good shot of my car next to the King, and now it's starting to pour rain. It is raining so hard right now. Um, I guess it calmed down a little bit when I started filming, but we are driving so slow. Thankfully, 
Uh, most of us, all of us in the Lambos are all wheel drive, but the Wyra is driving quite slowly, uh, rightfully, slow, uh, rightfully so, uh, because it's rear wheel drive. Really, really hard to see. One thing you don't really realize is a normal car spits up a lot less water from its rear tires because they're a lot skinnier. But something like an Aventador with ground effects and uh, very wide tires uh, spits up a ton of water uh, and makes it really, really hard to see. So we're giving each other some distance. Look, a normal car, a Lexus ES is passing us. We're gonna get to our destination and uh, wait it says about 30 minutes. Hopefully it stops raining when we uh, get further south. Doing a little fuel top off. About 20 minutes from our destination, gonna eat some food. I love the quilted leather interior in this thing. Awesome carbon fiber. I'm about to go for a ride in a Wyra. This is probably the best moment of my life. 